continues in Berkeley. It's the third weekend of conference play underway. The number 19 California Golden Bears host the number 21 Arizona Wildcats for game two of the Pac-12 series. Some clouds in the sky, a slight breeze around 55 degrees. But one, three and one. Misses low. Kennedy draws the walk. So Arizona. Slapped, right side, Bell has it. Tries to lay the tag on, she's called out. A Back to Archer. Quick look, but over to first. Out number two. Seen Haley Archer make some, especially in real time. If I'm the hitter, I, I'd like that to be a ball. Deep into right center field. No doubt about it. Touch them all, Ali Skaggs. The Wildcats struck first yesterday and they strike first again. Two runs come across on the long ball. Earlier in Pac-12 play this season and she takes this opposite field, even gets under it a little bit. But just an absolute tower into the trees. Outfitters knew that one was out of here. Swinging. So the long ball brings two across for the Wildcats, but Archer with the strikeout. Up the middle by Anders. Little leadoff base hit action. She continues her hot streak. Good adjustment from Anzalda. One and two. Back to Stoddard. She immediately goes to second. Over to first, not in time. The lead going is Anzaldo. She's in there safely. That is stolen base number 13 for her this season. Flown into left, going back for it. Right field rather, at the warning track, Altmeyer makes the catch. Tagging is Anzaldo. Both pitches from Stoddard so far, and it's one and one. Line to the right side. Skag scoops it, fires, and that does it. So Cal gets a runner aboard, but strands him. That's some nagging injuries she's dealing with. So we still see her in that DP position. And that's lined into left. Donardo's first hit of the series. Another leadoff base runner for the Wildcats. Off the glove of Herrera and advancing is Donardo. <laughs> Lined into left. Pond going back makes the catch. Tries to get the double play at second. But two. Lined to Butler. Diving backs Donardo. Another line drive out for the Bears. Grounded over to Butler, scoops, fires, and that does it. And the heart of the power on this team offensively starts things off with Elon Butler. Chopped up the middle, Beal to her left. Gets the throw to scoop in in time, one pitch, one out. Change up, waited on. Handled by Beal over to first. Back to back ground outs to the shortstop. Chopped again to Beal. And it's one, two, three. No big Beal over there at shortstop. It's options. Chopped over to Butler. Handled it. Over to first. Archer put Kennedy at second. That's hit hard on the left side. This time the power slap for the freshman and she's aboard. Now 
Four straight balls. Second walk in. Off the end of the bat, up the middle. Gets past everybody. Coming around to score is Shockey. That's gonna be run number three. Butler handles it. Over to first, a little bit high, but handled by Bell. She gets the sure out at first base. That's Chopped up the middle, Butler backhands off the back foot to first. Beautiful play on the right side and that will strand the runners. For Cal, she's a sophomore out of Torrance, transferred from Rutgers. Chopped back to Stoddard, overhands to first, wins the battle. Do it again, payoff pitch. Up the middle. Once again, moving well to her left is Beal. Laid down a squeeze bunt to bring in a run, put the ball in play to bring in a run. She puts it in play here to the right side. Skaggs has it, makes the play, and it's a 1-2-3 inning. Line right back up the gut. Shep with her first hit of the day. And it was a screamer. 2-2. Two, two. And it's crushed to right field. Out of here in a hurry. Taylor Beal was standing in and swinging away on that one. She turns on this one and it's a little bit down in the zone, lower half. So she gets that barrel angle. Her hands inside nicely. My car is actually parked not too far away from that one, so hopefully it's safe. And by 12, we've since hit three as this one is skied into the outfield. Pond coming over to make the catch in left center. That is out number one here. One and two here with one out. Dribbled to first, called fair, Bell takes it herself. That's how Caitlin Lowe said she can tell sometimes when players are gonna be great, not only players, but also in terms of leadership. And a strikeout here for Haley Archer. Her first time up, but this time it's into the outfield. Anzaldo with the line drive to get things going. Stoddard tries to take it herself. Does it successfully. Scoopin handles the throw at first base. And that one is sliced into center field. Diving back into second is Unzaldo. Watch that here. Two and two. Back to Stoddard. Overhand to first. Another ground out. Stoddard continues to roll. Into right field, coming up to make the catch on the dive is Johnson. Came out of her glove, but that was definitely on the transfer after the catch was made. Four pitch walk. So Skaggs aboard for the third time today. Just incredible. Again to Butler. She'll go to second. They'll try to turn two. Scoopin is safe at first. Inside outed. Pond once again on the run. Diving snag in foul territory. What a play by the left fielder to get out of the top of the fifth inning. Can Cal utilize that momentum to the top half of the inning? Trying to get them jump started as that's right back to Stoddard. Over to first, Herrera is retired. Another ground out. Payoff. Change up, waited on. Lined into center, but Shockey making it easy. Inside outed, and it lands in the outfield. Ryan Orange wins the battle. 
taking advantage of the opportunity in that DP slot today. Two outs for Mika Lee. Into foul territory. Coming to make the catch is Kennedy, and that'll do it. Lifted into the outfield. Coming in is Mika Lee. She'll make the grab. Off speed, got her swinging. What a response from Haley Archer. Her second strikeout, third actually now of the day. Line to Butler. Five straight retired by Haley Archer. Top of the sixth is over. Cap Takes ball four. A great at bat by Acacia Anders and the Bears have that base runner they need. Hit hard up the middle. Anzaldo wins the battle and it's two aboard for the Bears. Against Stoddard, this one here with Silva. Up and in, takes ball four. Couple of walks and a base hit in between makes it loaded here in the sixth. Ball, Coach Spencer said, Bell, one of the best rise ball hitting hitters in the country, but strikes out on the screw ball there. A huge strikeout for Silva for the first out. This is when that mantra, bear down, comes into play. Up and in, three pitch strikeout. Back to back K's for Aisa Silva. By five. Inside outs, Scoopin tries for the dive, but can't reach it. Do it again. Takes the rise ball. And Cal is on the board. Silva walks in the first run of the day for the Bears. Popped up, lifted into left. Kennedy coming in, she makes the catch. But the Bears are on the board. Hope Alley gets the RBI via the Gets her swinging on that one instead. Another strikeout on the day for Haley Archer. And that is chopped. Butler shaded on the other side of the bag. Nobody there. So Shockey winds up with her second hit. Off the glove of Kiroga and the runner advances. Shockey standing up at second. Another runner in the freebies. But she does just that. Behringer with the walk makes her way to first. Check swing she had earlier. And a swinging strikeout for Archer. That is a huge out. Nubbler. Anders to first gets it done. So another one comes across for the Wildcats. Cal trails by five. Skied into the outfield. Coming in, making the catch in shallow right center is Shockey. And it's four straight balls. The base runners that the Bears needed, Blaquez as well. Keisha Anders adds to the long ball tally. The Bears are not done yet. They're within three. And I said that this is exactly who you want up for a reason. She has, and this one is just crushed too much over the white of the plate and Anders takes advantage deepest part of the ball field past the pole, past the second fence. Deck, Bell would be due up in the hole. Change up, waited on, and it's lined into center field. 
Anzaldo does it again. Three singles in a row for this. Payoff pitch. Cold strike three. Stoddard paints that inside corner. And it's a huge tower into the stands. Oh my goodness. Tiana Bell, two run shot. The Bears are within one. Wow. Two home runs in this ball game for Cal. They both now just trailing by one. The inside pitch absolutely demolished by Tiana Bell. The Bears showing off that power. To right field, deep and gone! The Bears tie it up in the bottom of the seventh inning. Elon Butler, the Pac-12's home run leader, adds another one and ties this one up. Talking about. Butler goes oppo taco off the bat. You could tell she got all of it. Once again, clearing that second fence in right field. She is fired up. What a time. Inside pitch into foul territory. She'll have to make sure she has that plate coverage. Do it again, 2-2. Two, two. Change up, got her swinging. Lined into left, Pond all over it. Good swing, even better play, and it's one away. Center field, going back, making the catch is Mika Lee. Back-to-back -back line drives into the gloves of the outfielders. Two away for the Bears. Right center field, Lee there in front of the warning track. Three up, three down for Haley Archer. Cal trying to end this thing in the bottom of the eighth, coming up. Into right, going back for it, making the catch at the warning track. That is Paris Chica. She came in defensively late in the game. Softly cut off by Behringer. Over to Scoopin. Two down. Top of the order. We've got things going. Popped up into foul territory. Scoopin going back for it. And that's it. She grabs it. Grounded to Anders. Over to first. The ground out for out number one. Again, an important one. Skied into left. Pond on her horse, diving in foul territory. Kaylee Pond covers some ground in the green. Right to Anzaldo, quickly over to Bell, and that's it. Nothing across in the top of the ninth, still tied. corner. Anders stops at second. Might have had a chance for third, but Chelsea down, can slap, can hit away. Lays a bunt down here. It's back to Stoddard over to first. The sacrifice gets it done. How about that? Chelsea Spencer making the decision. A three for four hitter. Kaylee Pond. It's softly to the right side. Going home. Sliding in. Safe! She's safe! Kaylee Pond walks it off! Anders scores run number seven for the Bears. They even this thing up with the Arizona Wildcats. Is golden. So we'll see the rubber match tomorrow back here in Berkeley. What an exciting game, too.